like if you're trying to apply here in the Magnolia State. Gerald Harris joins us with how the governor is trying to improve the system. Gerald? Yeah, well, Mississippi has seen an 8,000% increase in unemployment claims. That equals about 87,000 Mississippians applying for unemployment benefits. Now, to give you an idea of how drastic this is, before the bull, full bone pandemic hit Mississippi, the state was averaging nearly 1,000 or below claims a week. The CARES Act passed by the federal government is admittedly complex and requires some working out. Officials say if you are out of work and you think you may not be able to qualify for assistance, to apply anyway. But we have increased the number of people at the call center from approximately 50 uh, three weeks ago to almost 150, and we hope to get to 250 within uh, the next several days and weeks. Through executive orders and the CARES Act, a number of usual requirements have been waived or loosened, including who is eligible for benefits and benefits for 1099 and contract workers are eligible. Those who are quarantined by a medical professional or a government agency, those who are diagnosed with COVID-19, those who are laid off or sent home without pay for an extended period by their employers due to COVID-19 concerns, or those who are caring for an immediate family members with COVID-19. Now, the CARES Act also provides you an additional $600 if you qualify and is eligible for the extra funding. Reporting in downtown Jackson, Gerald Harris, 12 News.